We may be treated to an once in 80,000 year site. An ancient comet discovered last year is passing by Earth. You'll be able to see it if the conditions are right. Jessica Gway talked with Pittsburgh astronomers and astronomy lovers to find out how you can catch a glimpse. 2024 has been full of cosmic reasons to look up. We put on our protective glasses to view a total solar eclipse. We were captivated by the northern lights more than once. And a comet. Now we have a comet. If I get to see the comet, it's just one more this year before the year is out uh, for celestial events. This is footage of the comet known as C-2023A3 on September 19th from a NASA astronaut. The icy dust ball will be closest to Earth on October 13th, and it'll put on a show after sunset each day through the end of October. It should be visible to your naked eye in the dark site, possibly to your naked eye here in Pittsburgh, um, or certainly with a small telescope and binoculars. Carrie Handron with the Allegheny Observatory says you can also see the comet by taking pictures on night mode on your phone. It's close to the sun, so you have to look westward when the sun goes down and wait a little bit. The comet is going to be fuzzy. It's going to have a tail, maybe two tails. That would be exciting. Uh, and we'll find it in the west. As the comet moves away from the sun, it'll get higher in the sky. Astronomer Simonetta Fritelli, a Duquesne University physics professor, says it's transforming to see a comet. I've seen pictures of it taken in other parts of the world already. It's beautiful. It's, it's very, very nice. But the comet is like it hangs. It hangs in the, in the night sky. It's just like floating there. And if you don't see this rare astronomical event, you're out of luck. This one comes about every once every 80,000 years. Might seem like a lot to you, but the Anthertals were walking the Earth at the time. So uh, they might have seen it. Astronomer Diane Turncheck, who teaches at CMU and Pitt, says the ancient comet may never come back. I mean, so many things in the sky are exciting, but there haven't been that many great comets in recent history. Jessica Gway, KDKA News. The best time to view the comet will be between the 14th and the 24th.